Maximizing Sustainable Yields. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 536. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution creating models in the service of all life on this planet. This includes highest good approaches to food, energy, housing, education, for-profit and non-profit business creation, society, and true earth stewardship. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the executive director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. This is July 2nd, 2023 edition of our weekly progress update. And today what I want to talk about is maximi- maximizing sustainable yields. And everything you see happening in the background of the video here are our open source plans, tools, tutorials, resources, designs for maximizing sustainable yields and not just in food or energy. Like a lot of people think of like, oh, sustainable yields, it's all about food or it's all about money. And it's absolutely not about that. Like if you're somebody paying attention to what's going on in the world right now, the problem isn't just about, well, some would argue that the problem is maximizing. It's this focus on GDP and maximization and living our lives uh, like we have infinite resources when the reality of it is, is we live on a finite world, you know? So, but one community, we talk about maximizing sustainable yields. We're not just talking about maximizing sustainable yields. We're talking about maximizing regenerative yields sustainably and creating a regenerative model that includes maximizing yields in all the foundations of sustainability. And we're not just talking about the physical foundations. We're talking about every week, which are food, energy, and housing but also the yields in um, the emotional foundations of sustainability, which we've identified as, and what we call, highest good approaches to fulfilled living, open source and free shared highest good approaches to education, economics, and true earth stewardship. Like putting, stewarding it all, and putting all this together to create a complete model that maximizes all of these things for the com- the benefit of the complete human experience and as a pathway to global sustainability within our lifetime to achieving the tipping point such that we can call ourselves a sustainable civilization doesn't mean that everybody's going to participate it means that we're going to get enough people on board benefiting from this and seeing the benefits for themselves for their friends for their families and creating creating it as a mainstream stream approach to living because enough people see it as better, providing a model that will be better than the way that people are living right now and making it easy enough, affordable enough, so that it will spread on its own. This is our idea for maximizing sustainable yields. And so we're addressing all the foundations of sustainability, the physical foundations, the emotional foundations. We're putting all these together, open sourcing and free sharing, all the tools, the tutorials, the resources, and do-it-yourself instructions as handy plans for replicating the complete model to create a teacher demonstration hub designed to teach others how to build teacher demonstration hubs as well so we can keep evolving all these open source plans and creating more and more options, iterations, versions of what it is that we're doing to address the differing needs, global needs and environments with open source and free shared sustainability plans that achieve the same goal of maximizing these sustainable yields in all of these different areas and open sourcing and free sharing it as individual components like that's a critical aspect of what it is that we're doing is we can't just open source a teacher demonstration hub because not everybody's going to want that so what we're doing is saying okay well let's address each of these critical areas of survival food energy and housing and each of these critical areas of fulfillment and happiness and living a wonderful life and maintaining all this but let's open source it as individual components so it can be replicated as individual components as well so that people that aren't interested in the complete model can still be a part of positive world change. So people that are interested maybe in just a little piece of this, maybe building a sustainable home that's built without toxic materials or growing food that tastes better and is healthier and not sprayed with poisons, the three common poisons that are sprayed on food nowadays, 
uh, and they want to be able to grow that for themselves or grow something that they can't buy in the grocery store because it doesn't have a shelf life, you know, or maybe it's their favorite food and they like to eat it fresh, you know, not from hundreds or even thousands of miles away, you know, as an example, or maybe they want to have a better education for their kids and want to start a community based education program and get to know the kids in their neighborhood and build community that way. But they're not interested in the complete community model that takes all these things and has this, you know, amazing fulfilled living model that includes a complete culture of personal growth and development, you know, and they're not interested in like implementing sustainable energy infrastructure or, you know, building sustainable housing or buildings, you know, it's just too much. Maybe they just want this one component. We're open sourcing and free sharing it all because our idea of maximizing sustainable yields is that we should be able to provide something for everyone. And that's what we're doing. We're saying it's possible to do this and it's necessary. It's, it's critical. It's essential that we provide something for everybody so that everybody who wants to participate can and so that we can move this process forward as quickly and as comprehensively as possible while creating a uniquely meaningful life experience for those that are interested in it, in the complete model and demonstrating that and making that easy enough, affordable enough and demonstrating that, that is attractive enough because that complete model, which is what one community is about, that takes all these things and puts them together and is designed so that the more amazing that environment is and the more we share open source and free share and give that away, the more it expands and grows and benefits us and humanity, like those two things being interlinked, the more we can show how to do that and the more amazing we can make that, the faster that idea, that to, we can create a global cooperation and collaboration of teacher demonstration communities, villages, cities, and hubs working for the highest good of all people in life and maximizing sustainable yields in all these different areas and evolving the ideas of how to maximize sustainable yields in all these areas and open sourcing and free sharing those evolutions so that there's even more options for this, for people to participate in and to be able to use and access, you know, in building all of this on the on the six sustainable, or sorry, the six foundational human needs, you know, is another thing that I haven't talked about in a while. You know, certainty and comfort, variety, significance, love and connection, growth and contribution. Putting all those things together in one place and building on those foundational human needs is a big part of creating this environment that will better meet the needs of people in the way they're living right now, and show what is truly possible when you nurture the human soul. When you set that as the goal of saying like, hey, this idea of creating a world that works for everybody, it's got to be built on like nurturing the human soul and creating places where people just feel better than they feel in other environments and showing people how to replicate that. So when people come and visit, they don't feel comfortable going back to their old life because they know that something better is possible. And then saying, hey, you can have this too. And if there's some aspect of what it is that we're creating and you don't like, that's great. It's all open source and free shared so you can take the pieces that you like and leave the pieces that you don't and create something better. And as a matter of fact, if you are willing to open source and free share your modifications, adaptations, evolutions, improvements, changes to what it is that we're doing at the same level that we are, we'll work directly with you to do that. We'll share our open source templates and our complete open source process. And we've already built the website infrastructure to promote your adaptations, modifications, and we're building the software to be able to cooperate and collaborate with you and coordinate this whole process and open source your objective data side by side with ours to show exactly how it differs and how, how similar it is and to make the whole process more efficient as well. That's how committed we are to this idea of maximizing sustainable yields. And our highest good network open source software that we're creating to be able to manage all this, it's awesome. It's awesome. It's amazing. You should see it. It's in the process. We've had hundreds of volunteers work on it. It is blowing up. We're moving into phase two of development. We are wrapping up phase one. Mind blowing what it is that we're creating. And that's just a piece you know, seven different sustainable village models, open source plans for energy infrastructure and building energy infrastructure into remote locations, how to do that sustainably and maximally ethically, how to build the healthiest, most nutritious, uh, safest food possible and diverse, more diverse than what you can get in the grocery store. The, the culture of growth and personal development, 
open source education model. Check it out. Visit our website. See what it is. We're a 100% volunteer organization creating this stuff because we want to live this way, because we want to help other people live this way, because we see it as a path to global sustainability within our lifetime, because it's a self replicating regenerative model that provides a way of living that's better than the way that most people are living right now and it's designed to be more affordable and more sustainable more durable and just pretty much better in all ways you know and for the first time in the history of the planet it's open source it's free shared and it's being, being developed to be accessible to everyone everywhere through the magic of the internet and a global team you know we've had uh, team members from 55 different countries contribute to our project over 700 almost 800 uh, volunteers at this point contributing to the project creating this because a sustainable world is possible within our lifetime so if you'd like to see what we're doing what all of our volunteers have done in the last week visit our weekly progress update blog if you'd like to see all this open source content that we've been creating all these details all these specifics visit our website if you would like to uh, get involved, visit our helping page. Of course, if you'd like to support us in the easiest way possible, like, subscribe, ring that bell, uh, subscribe to our weekly newsletter if you like a weekly dose of positivity in your inbox. And uh, yeah, stick around for a couple more minutes if you like to see bullet points and all the major components of our project. With that said, until next week, we will keep on keeping on engineering these maximizing sustainable yields models, demonstrating what's possible and creating this for the highest good of all people in life on this planet. Thanks for watching the end. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One Community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One Community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. One community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The One Community Approach to Highest Good Society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, four different economic models, and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.